Searching for better days Dreaming for peace of mind Hoping for change of pace Looking will you find what you see Good morning you guys, welcome to vlogmas day one. Without wanting to bore you guys to death, I can't believe it's vlogmas. I can't believe I haven't seen you guys over here for a month now. I have a few announcements before I want to continue talking. I apologise for my eyeliner first of all. All my eyeliners are running out and I'm having to use about three different ones to do my makeup every day and it just looks shite today. Also my hair, I haven't decided what I'm gonna do with it yet. I have missed you guys. Let me put you down for a second. So I've really, really missed you guys. November was quite a hard month. It was a lot, a lot of work. So I was quite glad I wasn't vlogging through it. Um, essays took a lot out of me and it was just a lot of work. Um, this past week I've been trying to wind down a little bit. I am really excited for Vlogmas and for Christmas, obviously but um, I am feeling a little bit end of termy and a little bit <laughs> exhausted. I've been trying to have a little bit of fun over the past um, few days and just chill out a little bit. I hope you are excited for Vlogmas. Um, now I know I mentioned in Vlogtober that um, I will not be finished with uni really until the 16th, but it's not all doom and gloom until the 16th or library vlogs until the 16th. I am actually gonna go to the farm this weekend um, I was going to go with the girls, but um, they've decided to stay up here and do some work or um, plans have changed. I think Rach might be coming. Zach's coming towards the end of the weekend. Um, but yeah, I was just going to go for a little bit of a break before um, exams and revision and work begins, um, which is why I'm going home so close to when I'm actually going home for Christmas. It seems a little bit illogical. Yes, that's the plan for this weekend. And tonight we are doing flat Christmas dinner, which is so exciting. I love flatness. Um, I also want to say really sorry, you guys, that there wasn't a pre-vlogmas this year. I know that I usually do one, um, but we really did nothing Christmassy in November, like, at all. Um, the the Coca-Cola truck didn't even come to Edinburgh this year, which we were all pretty annoyed about. And I just haven't found the time to make my way to the Christmas markets or anything yet. So hopefully it'll all be coming at you in Vlogmas, which is when it should be coming at you. But um, yeah, I'm really sorry about pre-Vlogmas. I actually do have a little clip though um, of me opening one of my advent presents a little bit earlier, which I will insert here. Hi guys, so I'm not sure what the date is actually, I'm just gonna have a look. It's the 27th of November today. Um, the girls, I was in the library today, the girls made a delicious casserole in the slow cooker and I came home for dinner and we watched Planet Earth. It's a Sunday today. Um, I love Planet Earth so much. And we're actually gonna open one of our collective advent presents. Um, my stepdad sent us up what appears to be from the box, some wine or something like that. And, um, he okayed the fact that we could open this before the 1st of December, so it's not that naughty, but we thought we'd open it tonight just because we're having dinner together, it's a Sunday, and we're just chilling and watching TV, which we never really get to do, so <laughs> I'm gonna go and open it now. This was our card. Oh my god! What's that gonna be? <gasps> what is it? Yeah. Oh my god! Thank what you, a Mom! Treat. Oh. <gasps> oh my god! What a treat! Nice bit of bubbly. Is it gonna focus? No. Yeah, you gotta wiggle it. Wiggle it, wiggle it, pop to the drop, to the drop. Yeah. Got us. Focus. 
Next up, we have to open other advent presents. So let's do this because I'm really excited. You guys may remember this box um, from October. Make way. foundation hands or anything look at this it's so beautiful it's like a big old book oh my goodness oh my god it's so beautiful it smells amazing like literally amazing i don't know where this is gonna live though i think it's gonna have to go up on my table over there, so let me put it up there. Number one. I don't want to like rip it or. Oh, it's a candle. Oh, I think I've had this one before, and I really love the smell of this one. It's figure. I believe this is the one that's supposed to kind of smell like woods. And then I've also got this, which was sent to me this morning, which is from NYX. I believe it's mostly their um, soft matte lip creams, which I love their soft matte lip creams. I have um, a few of them already, but this is number one. Ooh, I love this color. I should have worn this today. should not have put my lipstick on already. One sec. Here we are, you guys. This is Monte Carlo. Soft matte lip cream. And I don't know how much that advent calendar retails for, but I think this would be such a cool calendar to get. I know it's a bit late now, but if you are looking to get someone like a late present or a late calendar, this would be, I think that would be really cool. That's the colour there. So nice. So you guys, I also have to quickly show you before I head into uni um, <clears throat> what I did last night. Look at that calendar, it's too much for me. It's so beautiful and um, goes all the way up to the 25th as well, which I think is just that extra bit of like goodness. Um, this by the way is a box full of stuff for a lookbook, um, which will be coming your way hopefully at some point this month. I don't want to show you guys for too long, but all of these packages are actually Christmas presents and I'm going to take them to the farm on the weekend so I can kind of get rid of them out of my room. But yeah, that's what those are. If you are wondering why my room has been overtaken by cardboard boxes. So I also Christmasified my room a little bit yesterday. I don't have my normal Christmas bedding because like I said to you in Vlogtober, I don't know if you guys remember. Um, I left it at the farm and I still haven't been back home in order to pick it up which is what I kind of originally planned to do so um, I got this snowy scene on sale at Marks and Spencer's I think I got it like half price in the end and I think it's real nice just a bit of a different look it's really really silky though which is amazing I've got my little golden tree which is looking a bit worse for wear for having been packed away as so many times got my holly oh let's do outfit whilst we're here i think i wore this exact probably this exact outfit in um vlogtober i'm not sure whether i wore these jeans but um yeah i just threw on this shirt today because it's easy although it's horribly creased <laughs> so don't judge me um then i put some tinsel it's mostly tinsel from here on out to be honest we've got tinsel there so i've got some tinsel on my um rack rail got my merry christmas which always comes off my door so i decided to just place it up there i've got um tinsel around my mirror i've got some very pitiful tinsel over on the wardrobe as well i christmas fied thoroughly yesterday in preparation for vlogmas um but now i'm gonna go to the library you guys because um i am running late after all my christmas themed activities <laughs> Heaven, Zion, bliss, escape. 
Even though the truck isn't coming. There's no thing. There's a dial. Cute. Someone's defiled the Ferrero Rocher. Look, I'm my festive headgear, you guys. You may remember this. From pre Vlogmas last year, decided to buy it this year. I know I look a little crazy, but um, we just got back from the shops. I feel like I've been awful with vlogging today. I'm just going to have to get back in the swing of it a little bit. Um, but yeah, we bought all of our Christmas dinner stuff. Um, took us ages in the end because we were did dithering over which bits to buy. We are back now and we are going to head over to the girls' flat, which is where we are cooking tonight um, and eating because they have more table space, more table room. Um, and yeah, we've got to lug some wine and stuff over there. But I'm so excited to have a really nice evening with the girls and just enjoy ourselves and be Christmassy. Aho! Uh -oh. That's real cute. So yes, we're going to head over there now. I had a dissertation meeting today which lasted about five minutes. It was... I was reading in the library. One of my dissertation books is what I'm reading at the minute. Um, so I've just was doing some reading on that. Um, I'm trying to get all the primary texts read over this Christmas period um, for my dissertation so I can start like properly properly thinking about it and I'm going to reread some of them as well. So anyway, I was reading for that today in the library and then I went to my meeting at two, literally lasted about seven minutes maximum. They just kind of want to check on your progress and stuff and I feel like I'm in a good place like nobody really quite knows what they're gonna write yet um, but I know what text I'm using, what kind of um, where my kind of focus is gonna be ish. So that's good, that's pretty much the only interesting thing that happened at uni today and then we had some lunch and then we headed out to the shops and let's go and make some food because I am starving. This is Kath's tart and bedding everyone. This is Kath. Hiya. Hi Kath. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> oh my god, so cute. Super cute. <laughs> Don't be scared. <laughs> Oh, these expressions are maybe too much, Jesse. I just got back from an impromptu night out. It was good. I am feeling a little bit drunk. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. So I will see you guys tomorrow. I'm gonna sign the vlog off here. Thank you so much for watching today and I hope you enjoyed. Tomorrow the plans are I'm gonna edit all day. I think I'm gonna edit this and then I've got um, a couple of main channel videos that could do with editing really that I'd like to upload whilst I'm at the library because you guys know what the internet at the farm is like. I will see you again tomorrow. Bye.